Right, and uh, welcome back to the second half of Bullseye. This week we bring in a celebrity who plays darts. We really have got one tonight. One of the greatest names the soccer world has ever known. You listen to this audience as they react, as they see the talent and the sight of Mr George Best. <laughs> Oh, you must you get that reaction everywhere you go. Well, it's nice. I think people still remember the football side of it, you know, oh, so it's, yeah. it's very no, important it's to me. Yeah. One of the game's greatest characters, I've got to say that. Delighted to meet you for the first time today, actually. Tell that 11 million out there what's happened to you now. Tell us what you're doing. Uh, I coach kids and play exhibition games, but yeah. uh, mostly the coaching with the kids, which I enjoy tremendously. You do? And I go to places, I've been to Hong Kong, Malaysia. I actually coached the Malaysian national team for a week and enjoyed it. For the Olympics last, yeah. mm -hmm. last few weeks yeah. ago. So I'm uh, have boots will travel really. I'm, I'm traveling around you're the world. You're still in the game, and there's another thing you do that the public don't know about. You do a lot of charity matches, don't you? Mm -hmm. And it's a, a fact, apparently, all of you here tonight and at home, that George has raised over half a million pounds for charity. Now that's worth a round of applause, I think. Isn't it? <laughs> now, you didn't know I was going to say that, did you? <laughs> we'd like you tonight. Uh, we're thrilled to bits to have you with us. Uh, we'd like you to throw tonight 301 or more with nine darts. We give you 60 to start. We know you're a fair player because we've been looking at you today. We'd love you to do it, and if you can do that, Central will double that amount and give it to the charity chosen by our finalists. The audience are with you, everyone at home is with you. Off you go. George Best, throwing for charity. Thank you. Good luck, George. <laughs> so is George. So the rest now is the best. It's 12. It's a 20. Another 20, that's 52 plus 60, so that's 112. Another 20, that's 45, so that's 157. Five. Five. Another 20, that's 30, but that's 187. Thank you. Well done, sir. Thank you very much indeed. Uh, well, it's... Not easy, is it? No, that's real. I haven't mm -hmm. played for about two years. I used to play regularly. But oh, well, obviously, we, we, we saw you today and we knew you, you did play quite a, quite a lot. We'd like you to meet the two guys who got to the final tonight who do stand to make a lot of money for themselves on top of what you've made. Please welcome the boys back in here. Come on, boys, in you come. Ken and Phil, in you come. Meet George Best. Come on, boys. Thank you. Now then, now then, David and Ken, tell George and, and myself about this charity you've chosen. Well, it was Ken's idea, so I'd prefer if he told you. Come on, then, to... Ken. Um, Doctors have got together in the local area of Lingshire and uh, they've organised themselves so that they can get to um, road accidents as fast as possible um, yeah. by putting radios in their cars and in their homes. And this is, is the, um, it's called the Lives Appeal, which yeah. stands for the Lingshire Integrated Voluntary Emergency Service. Yeah, good. And that's what it's about, saving lives. That's right. A different charity as well, that, and I'm sure very, very worthwhile. You've got £187, courtesy of our very, very talented Irishman, George. Thank you very much for coming on the show. Jim, as, I, as I didn't throw too well, I'll put another hundred pound in. For the well. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. As ever, George always there with a surprise. That's marvellous. So you've two hundred and eighty-seven pounds, courtesy George Best, throwing and his own generosity. Now then, boys.